Hello and welcome to Naivety Gaming. I'm your host Matt and this is the 26th week of Cheap Weekly Thrills. For those who don't know, Cheap Weekly Thrills is where I browse Steam and find games that have been released in the past week for $5 or less. Now, uh, this week is a little bit of an interesting one on a couple of different occasions um, because the game technically might have not been released within this past week but technically also might have been um it is a game called the balcony and the balcony is a challenging yet satisfying physics based game the game consists of two game types the campaign and the zombie mode um essentially well i think many of you probably have already seen this game before um, because I believe the technical re release date was November 3rd, 2017, and what it was was probably an early access, but as of this week, I believe actually as of today, I think it's no longer in early access, and it's, uh, it's here. It's finally released. So, like I was saying before, many of you have probably already seen this game through other YouTubers and other internet personalities. Uh, already playing this game, which is fine, but I personally have not seen, well, I have seen this, I personally have not played this, and, uh, we'll find out momentarily if it actually runs on, uh, this computer, my poor, poor, poor computer that I put through a lot of strain. Um, so yeah, I was gonna say a special promotion that they've got going on is 20% off until April 2nd which I believe is exactly one week from this recording date, which is a Monday. Sorry about that. Um, and it's normally $4 and it's currently $3.19. So it's a good little deal for those wanting to pick up this game uh, during its release week. But anywho, I'll give this a test and fingers crossed this actually does work because I've been very intrigued about this game for a while and would like to see how it uh, functions. So, like I said, I'll give it a little test and we'll see you guys in just a moment. Hello and welcome to The Balcony, the game where you use gravity-based physics to throw objects and kill targets. And, uh, let's jump straight into the campaign and uh, see if this will work. I'll just skip all this tutorial stuff. No, oh, we'll have to. Yep, skip that. Okay. So, your assignment. Your one target belongs to the red shirt group. The target is known for fooling the insurance companies by creating fake accidents. Boss. So, if we use WASD and use our mouse to kind of look around, we can see. That doesn't seem very fake, but I can also see that this red shirt guy uh, probably did a break stand and just, you know, it's just like, hey, insurance scams. So, we'll open up that. Eh. Eh. Hey, he did it. Just in the back of the head. Perfect. I did it. I did it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, level two. Your two targets also belong to the red shirt group. They have been robbing people on the bus rides. They have been seen. They have been seen robbing people on buses and whatnot. Okay, I was curious what that water noise was. It was like, is somebody just taking a piss on the street? Come on. So naturally, I shall grab one of the largest objects in this room. Perfect. Just... Just shove that out the door, that's fine. Eh. That was utterly pathetic, like the majority of things in my life. So... How about this table? No. I want this table. How about this chair? No. <sighs> just, just, table. Please, come with me. Oh, 
Oh, there goes that idea. I wonder if I can grab... Ooh, perfect, I can. So let's... Eh. <laughs> can you imagine just standing there? Just minding your own business? Then suddenly you look over to your right and you're like, what's that piece of splintered wood doing there? Hmm. So apparently with this I need to give it a little... Chuck. <laughs> okay. This is definitely not going the way that I want it to be. Um, so let's try this little flower pot. And still getting the perspective of that man, and you just suddenly a flower pot hits the bus sign right next to you. Ah, <laughs> uh, there we go. Eh. I did it finally. <laughs> After I've cleared out the majority of my house just to get rid of that one guy. First try. Not first try. <laughs> I let go way too early there, guys. Um, how about this? This thing. This will work, right? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so bad at this! Ugh! <laughs> Oh, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Here, this is a pillow. This could kill him, right? Please? Please? I have emptied this house. What more do you want from me? Ah. Oh. And I can't even get out my own stupid doorway anymore. That's fantastic. Yay! Seven object points. Soul seven of them. I'm okay. <laughs> Maybe I'll do one or two more levels. I'm enjoying this way too much for my own good. But uh, I think as you guys can tell, I'm just horrifyingly bad with all video games, as you'll see in the uh, Rocket League uh, episode that you'll see coming out on Friday. Spoiler alert, it's Rocket League, and spoiler alert, I'm still bad. Um... Your one target belongs to the red shirt group. The target is impersonating an employee of a tire changing company, but for real, all the target is doing is stealing items from the customer's cars. Lovely. And ironically, we also do have tires that we can too use against him. So this time, we actually have a lot. Oh. We have a lot fewer items to utilize. But, uh, here we go. Perfect. How about this thing? This little tire. Uh, cat. And, oh, yep. Nope. I'm noticing as I'm throwing it, my, uh, mouse goes slightly to the left, so. Look out! Frick. Well, you don't have to worry about him anymore. Dude, what a shot! I threw a table all the way onto the other person's roof. That was awesome. I can kill a person with a boot? I will absolutely attempt to do that. This has got to be fun. Ugh. I need to try harder than that. <laughs> Just flip that table. Get rid of that stuff out of there. Don't mind me. Uh, unbelievable. I have two more objects. Please. Please work with me on this. 
Oh, come on. Uh, come on, Mr. Boot. Come on. Come on. I did fall off the balcony. Anyway, round two. Hopefully I'll make this a speed round for you guys' to sanity. It's only one person. It should not be this hard. Just get rid of them. Just... I'm gonna need to throw a lot harder than that. Okay, come on. What am I doing with my life? Just get over there. I killed a person in there? Who cares? Everybody over there is dead. Nope. Get rid of this table. Hammer will do. Nope. I am so bad at this. <laughs> Uh. Well, one last try. That's all I'm getting myself. Uh, who needs windows anyway? Windows are so 2017. Are you kidding me? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Just kill them, stupid. I don't even care anymore. Kill them too while you're at it. <laughs> Just the bouncing off the dead corpse of Mr. Yellow Shirt. Yeah, okay, whatever. Unbelievable. This game hates me and I hate the game, so at least we've got a similar uh, relationship going on. Can you imagine the white shirt person just watching a guy, like, actively trying to kill a person across the street by throwing literally anything and everything out of his house? Well, apartment. Just... Why? Sure, whatever this is. This seems like a plumbing thing. There we go. See up. So that was the balcony. A like I said, a game where you use gravity to actively try to kill other people, probably across the street or down below you. So if you guys uh, liked this content, make sure you like and subscribe. We can always use a couple more subscribers around here. And uh, also, if you picked up this game or you've picked up another game for $5 or less, let us know in the comments section down below and let us know how you, well, if you enjoyed said games or not. Um, and all, as always, this has been the 26th week of Cheap Weekly Thrills. I am your host, Matt, and we'll see you guys next week. So. Bye-bye.